We gotta go talk to Mr. Krabs and Plankton. I'm sorry, what the fuck did you just say, Patrick? Oh, I can... Oh, wait, never mind. Just call me a flying fish! Ah. If you weren't grilling those patties like an amateur has never cooked before, I wouldn't have to use my chum. Just follow my lead! If I was following your lead, me precious patties would taste like your disgusting chum! Mr. Krabs, what are you doing here? Are you working with Plankton? I had no choice. The poor citizens of Bikini Bottom were starving. I couldn't let him eat the garbage Plankton was serving. I'm right here! So we struck a deal to feed those poor, hungry mouths. So long as they pay, of course. Well, if you don't hurry with those patties, Krabs, nobody will be fed. Then you'll have to say goodbye to your sweet money. SpongeBob, you gotta help us. You're the only one I trust with me secret formula. Could you fix us some more Krabby Patties? I'm on it, Mr. Krabs. So am I hungry? I'm actually gonna make food. Food and attention. Ah, you gotta let them sit. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, this mini game's actually not that bad. Thanks, boyo. I know how you like playing dress up. So I've got a little reward for helping out your favorite employer. Okay, we go back to Cassandra. Hello, Cassandra. I couldn't help but overhear you miss your little pet snail, Walter. Gary. Right, Gary. Well, with this cosmic costume, you should be able to enter the portal he was sucked into. But watch out, honey. That snail of yours is in big, big trouble. Oh, this is where the flower one comes in, isn't this? Ooh, a pretty flower costume. We must be going to some gentle land of sunshine and kindness. Well, I wouldn't say that with the pumpkin and the uh, cracked shells right here, and the graveyard in the back. So, uh. Gare Bear, I'm coming for you! I mean, I already read through it, so I know it's coming. I read through a walkthrough, so I know it's coming. Oh, this is also part of the trailer for the game, if you didn't see it. Look at these creatures, Patrick! They're... they're... Funny? No! Scary! Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was gonna be my second guess. No, this whole place is frightening! It's cold, it's moist, and it smells like the dumpster behind the chum bucket! Well, that sure sounds a lot like this puddle of ooze you're standing in. Yeah. It must be the remains of the victims of the monster that came through here. We have to hurry and find Gary. Wait, why do they call this down? They call this Halloween Bikini Bottom. This is just rock bottom. <laughs> and it just looks spooky. Also, I like the reference. Squishy. Could you stop saying that? I love the reference of his costume. If you remember, the, the, it, the day I'm actually recording this is the first day of June, which uh, is a great month fucking shit but um remember the, f the ep there was an episode of uh I, was it the ep was it Krabby Land was the name of the episode where Mr. Krabs is like so fucking cheap that he like builds his own theme park and it's the shittiest fucking thing ever and I think Spongebob has to tell him about the wonders of the first day of summer oh Oh no. At least you're kind of fast when he's chasing you. A spooky sludge. A sludge. Well, maybe we can hide in that bush. Evade the spooky jelly. By hiding in a bush. Alright. 
I was convinced he didn't see me. Just pretend that scary equals funny and play hide and seek with them. Great idea. And we'll win because they're not even seeking. Yes, definitely. How to boo scare? So you can kill him? You probably just need to be really well hidden. You know how useful that would have been? Like, so much long ago. Shouldn't we help this candy find a warm and safe place? Too bad I left my candy bar bag in my candy bar bag carrying bag. I guess I have to put it in my mouth instead. Wait a t wait a tide. Something about this ooze seems very f mm. 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 calcium with a faint trace of protein and lots of love. That's not ooze, that's slime! Gary slime! That is a lot of slime for such a tiny snail. He must be so scared. We gotta find him! That's disgusting. All we have to do is just follow this slime trail through the dark, scary, horrifying city. It's only moderately horrifying up close. You don't s <laughs> you don't see me. That town gives me the creeps. Ooh, I hope they give us creeps. I want mine with powdered sugar. Oh, you're thinking of crepes, Patrick. Crepes! <laughs> that awful slime left by that monster. What disgusting creature could do that? Uh, I'm assuming Gary? Hey, it's that guy! Oh. Mrs. Puff, what are you Excuse doing here? Me? Have you seen? I'm afraid I have not. I'm in the middle of crucial organizing business for the Snail Cup. Oh, sorry, it's Mrs. Fluff, not Mrs. Puff. If you want to enter the race, you need to pay the participation fee of five candy bars. Oh, green. One way to get the amount of candy we need. Take it from babies? No, we go trick or treating. Oh, that works too, I guess. Well, I mean, yeah, we could take it from babies. Trick or treat! Have you seen my snail? Tiny, cute, sweet, with very expressive eyelashes. If he's really sweet, then the monster probably took him. He ruined everyone's Halloween by stealing our sweets. The last time it was seen, it crawled down the racing track. I think the track probably leads all the way to its lair. There it feasts on innocent candy and pets. Poor Gary. Patrick, we need to find more candy to get on that racing track. Here, have one of my candy bars for the participation fee. Your awesome costume deserves it. Thanks. My awesome costume. Yeah, I'm just a flower. Hey, kid. I can't understand your accent. Trick or treat. Oh. Why didn't you say so? Here. Have a candy bar. And nice costume, by the way. Thank you. I swear, these people that live in this... In, in Rock Bottom are like fucking French Canadians. You don't speak French, they don't understand. They, they're not gonna help you. <laughs> you what a nice costume how can i help you young fellows candy 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 oh of course sweetie here have a candy bar ah! oh that's nasty wow vintage thanks vintage the thing's probably as old as her i've been trying to find chocolate for three days there's almost nothing left. Except for, well, I could tell you, but 
You have to promise to split the spoils. I'm all ears. Well, actually, I'm mostly cellulose, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, a weird and very heavy rock crashed behind my house. Right on my chocolate shed. Maybe you can move it. Here, let me open the gate for you. Oh, great. Thanks, Tom. Thanks a lot, Tom. Now I gotta go do your fucking dirty work. Can you stop saying you like it squishy, please? Oh! <laughs> it was Patrick's rock! <laughs> that was... that. <laughs> Alright, that was kind of funny. Hey, Tom. Chocolate! Chocolate! Finally, chocolate! Well, if it weren't for Gary, I could go home and watch Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy reruns. You better have a good reason for being in trouble. Um, because we played with magic bubbles and tore into the fabric of reality, creating cosmic chaos that puts all of Bikini Bottom in danger? We said good reason. <laughs> That's not a good enough reason, apparently. Sweet Neptune, are you insane running around like this? Don't you know people have phobias? Sorry, I didn't know my costume was that scary. What are you afraid of? Boxes, man, boxes. You never know what'll be inside or where they'll take you. And then it's too late. And you look just like one. All square-like. Sometimes boxes have good things in them, like Krabby Patties. Oh, yeah. I guess you're right. Here's some candy. Thank you. Balloons? Don't you know people have phobias? That's all the candy we need. Now we can give it all away to Mrs. Pop. It's Mrs. Fluff, not Puff, SpongeBob. You again? Did you bring the participation fee candy? With nuts! That's disgusting. Fancy. Now keep still. This is going to hurt. Wait, what? It's a snail race. You have to be a snail and fast. Go! Am I gonna. Are you gonna turn me into a snail? Oh my god. What the fuck? How to snail mode. So you just mash X to climb? Oh my god. This is. I, I don't like these controls. Hey, look at that! We finished the race! What's going on here? Michael Jackson? Oh, that's not too bad. You, you're glowing! Who, who said that? How do you know my name? It's me, Patrick. I thought I was Patrick. No, I'm SpongeBob, you're Patrick. What did that do? Turn on the lights. Do something! These cables are glowing! Maybe they feel pretty. Oh, okay. So I gotta just turn on all the... Gotta smash all the cables, got it. Was that the hash-slinging slasher I just saw? Oh, right here, duh. <laughs> wow. That is a very, very bright light. Oh, yeah, I know what we gotta do. I mean, <clears throat> Sandy. The name's Candy, with a C as hard as the toffee in Grandma's candy dish. Thank you for bringing the power back. We're looking for my pet snail, Gary. He got lost, probably kidnapped by a monster. Uh, have you seen him? Haven't seen your pet around, I'm afraid. But that monster, they say its lair is in the museum. It's dangerous, but it might be your best chance of finding your little critter. Sounds reasonable. We should ask this monster if it's seen Gary. Patrick, I don't think monsters can talk. You know what? My little monster theater has been reset. 
You mind giving me a hand with putting it back in order? If you do, I'll open the way to the museum for you, so you can go look for that monster and your friend. I don't like it, but if there's a chance Gary is with this monster, we have no other choice. Oh, poor Gary. Let's get this theater fixed. Okay. I mean, this this is super easy. Do I just gotta whack it or something? Exactly. Um... Something ain't right here. Oh, I... I see. There we go. Thanks, Square Man. Now take your floating buddy out of here before there's an audience arriving. Can't have a scary show with this jolly balloon bobbing about. Okie dokie. I'm out of here. Tongues out, fun's out. Tongues out, fun's out. That's a good one. How far away is the museum? Jesus. The museum oh, here we are. You know, I was expecting there to be a big cutscene. Told you. Look at all those snails the monster kidnapped. Look, it's Gary. So how do we save Gary without that monster snail seeing us? Gary is the monster snail. Huh? They grow up so fast, don't they? These massive amounts of candy bars must have given him a sugar rush. We can't take him back home like this. We have to cut off his candy supply first. Already on it, buddy. How am I going to defeat Gary? Ooh. Go. Wait. Go. Oh, great. Now he's barfing on me. Oh! Thank you, Gary. Can I hide behind one of the snails? I can. That's unique. Oh, thanks, Gary. Oh. Mm -hmm. There we go. before we're all buried in the rubble. But Gary is still giant! Don't worry. I'm sure he'll go back to normal once we get him home. I sure hope you're right, Patrick. I've never been wrong about anything yet. I got a trophy earned scaredy pants. And I think that didn't even take me that long either. For once in my life, I think I might have been wrong. So is Gary just giant now? Huh. I guess Gary's just big now. Alright. Well. That's it for right now, guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, do hit that like button, bell button, share button, and subscribe button. I'll see y'all next time. Have a great day. Bye bye